Every year in the United States, homeowners are responsible for adding 64 million gallons of unused paint to our landfills. That's enough to fill 128 Olympic swimming pools. Here at Scarce, we find ways to help reduce what could end up in our landfills. This video will show you what to do with your leftover and unwanted household paint. The first step is to reduce the amount of paint you buy. Only buy the amount that you will need. Even with the most careful planning, you are bound to have some paint left over. Here are some creative ways on how you can reuse it. Use it for touch-ups. Use it for different craft projects. Ask around. Maybe a neighbor could use the leftovers. Or bring it to a Habitat for Humanity restore. These restores will only accept paint cans that can still be considered full. Yet in order to reuse paint, it will have to be stored properly. First, cover the opening of the paint can with plastic wrap. Put the lid on securely with the least amount of airspace. Make sure it does not leak. Then, turn the can upside down to allow the paint to create its own seal. Finally, you can store the can upside down in a place that's safe from freezing and out of the reach of children and pets. Remember, if the paint freezes over the winter, it is no longer able to be reused. Scarce tip! Store the paint in a glass jar in the room where you would use it again. That way you can easily see the color and it's right where you need it. If there's no way to reuse your paint, here's how to dispose of it properly. Remember, do not pour any paint down the storm drains or attempt to burn it. The first step to proper disposal will depend on the type of paint. If it is oil-based or any type of aerosol spray paint, it must be dropped off at your local household hazardous waste facility. The information about these events can be found on Scarce's website. Please check online for your closest facility. If you are trying to dispose of latex paint, you will first have to dry the paint. First, find some kind of drying agent. Next, if you have multiple cans, combine all of the paint into one. Now you can mix the drying agent into the can. Let it sit until your paint is no longer liquid. Then put your dry mixture into the trash. And finally, put the dry and empty cans into your curbside recycling bin. Scarce tip! Throughout the drying process, be sure that there are no children or animals around. The paint is toxic. Remember, first reduce, and then find ways to reuse. Only after attempting these steps should you find ways to dispose of the paint.